As Peyton Manning sat at his locker, it was hard to tell if the AFC Championship game was over or about to begin. Manning has been so many things in his career, great, brilliant, hyperactive, angle retentive, intense, a workaholic. He has rarely seemed at ease. But this was a different day, and a different Peyton. There was something about him today, something great, Broncos running back Monty Ball said. I think it was how calm he was. He was just talking to us. He just went about his business. Just his mannerisms, everything he did, he was just calm out there. Manning did more than just beat Tom Brady and the Patriots 26-16 to lead Denver to the Super Bowl. He stole Brady's adjectives. On this day, Manning was cool, efficient and patient. He made it look easy. There were two reasons for that, a three-year reason, and a three-hour reason. The three-year reason, when Manning sat out the 2011 season because of a neck injury, he had plenty of time to contemplate life without football. Manning, the number one high school recruit in the nation, the Heisman favorite as a Tennessee senior and number one overall pick in 1998, was suddenly an underdog. He doesn't have the arm strength now that he once did, but this may actually help him, because he doesn't force as many throws as he once did. He is more willing to ride his team. One of Manning's best plays against the Patriots came on a 3-RD and 10, when he audibled into a run play, to ensure Denver would get a few yards and a field goal try. No Sean Moreno ran for a first down, but that wasn't even the point. Manning was willing to hand the possession to his running back so his place kicker could try a field goal.